this greatest integer function we have to prove that it is not differentiable at 1 and it is also not differentiable at 2. It is we have considered here x is lying between 0 and 3. First we will check the differentiability at 1. We will find out what is the left derivative limit as h tending to 0 1 minus h minus divided by it will be minus h. This is going to be the left derivative for finding out the derivative at x is equal to 1. Now, when I replace the value h tending to 0, this will be the greatest integer function corresponding to this expression minus the greatest integer function corresponding to 1 divided by minus h. This value 1 minus h and h is something close to 0. So, the value will be less than 1. It might be something like a 0 0.99, 0 0.998 and so on. So, the greatest integer function corresponding to that will become 0 minus greatest integer function for 1 is going to remain only 1. We have the limit as h tending to 0 and in the denominator I have a minus h. So, it is a h tending to 0 when you simplify it, it becomes a minus 1 by a minus h or it will actually simplify to h tending to 0, it will just become a 1 by h. Here when you simplify also, it was a limit as h tending to 0, this limiting value was 0, this functional value was 0 minus the next value was 1, this is divided by a minus h. When you simplify this is what you get, this will become, it is not a finite value, it becomes infinity. Right derivative will be limit as h tending to 0, f of it is a 1 plus h minus f of 1 divided by h this will be h tending to 0 greatest integer function for this minus a similar one for 1 it is divided by h greatest integer function corresponding to 1 plus h it will be something like h is of course close to 0 so, the expression inside might be looking like a 1.001, 1.0001 and so on. So, the functional value will be 1, the functional value here will be 1, this is of course 1 divided by h, numerator becomes 0, so limiting value the entire thing will be equal to 0. So, here we see that the left derivative and the right derivative both are completely different here because of which f of x is not differentiable at this point x is equal to 1 because one left derivative we have got it as infinity the right derivative we have got it as 0 they are different it is not differentiable. We will now check for x is equal to 2. For x is equal to 2, left derivative when you go to it, it will be the limit as h tending to 0, f of 2 minus h minus f of 2, it will be divided by a minus h. Now, this will be limit h tending to 0 greatest integer function here minus divided by minus h. This will be first term will become 1, this will be a 2 here 
divided by minus h and again here when you simplify it will become infinity because it is just going to be a 1 by h if you uh, substitute or if you take the limit as h tending to 0 the limit will become infinity. Right derivative limit h tending to 0 2 plus h minus this is divided by h limit h tending to 0 greatest integer function here minus divided by h first term it will be 2 second is also 2 this is divided by h of course this will simplify to 0. So, here again left derivative and the right derivative are different therefore f of x is not differentiable at x is equal to 2. If it is a 4 mark question we go to all these details. Suppose the same thing is just asked as a 1 mark question. If it is asked as a 1 mark question you can conclude that this particular function is not continuous at 1, it is not continuous at 2 also. Uh, greatest integer function is actually discontinuous at every integral value. So, definitely it is not continuous at 1, it is not continuous at 2. In that case if it is not continuous definitely it is not going to be differentiable. A function has to be continuous to even check the differentiability. So, the first condition continuity if itself if it is going to be ruled out the function is not going to be differentiable. If it is a one mark question you can just write that it is discontinuous at 1 and also at 2 therefore, it is not differentiable. But if the question is uh, you know a 4 mark question or even a 2 mark question for each point that is for x is equal to 1 left derivative and right derivative you have to compare it. Similarly, the point x is equal to 2 left derivative and right derivative you have to compare and then come to the conclusion about conclusion that at both the points that is at x is equal to 1 and also at x is equal to 2 both the points it is the function f of x is not differentiable.